On behalf of the Alumni Committee of Conrad Vrabel University College, I am so pleased to announce the selection of Andrew Reeser McDowell, a Grebel Waterloo alum from 1976, as this year's recipient of the Distinguished Alumni Service Award. Let me tell you just a bit about him. Andrew came to Grable from the Toronto Markham area where his family was deeply involved in Mennonite church leadership. Fraser Lake Camp near Bancroft was one example. Andrew spent many years there as a camp counselor. Andrew majored in sociology at the University of Waterloo with an abiding interest in religious studies. He roomed with Gary Lease. Decades before Mennonite church integration, these two young men spearheaded joint youth events that included the Western Ontario Mennonite Conference, from Gary's background, and the larger Mennonite Conference of Ontario, where Andrew's father, Emerson, was a pastor. During his formative time at Grable, Andrew and Gary also participated in a unique Mennonite voluntary service experience, traveling to the southern U.S. with a music group, Andrew negotiated with then Grable President Winfield Fretz to arrange an independent study credit for this experience and thus began his first successful efforts at persuasive advocacy. <laughs> While at Grable, Andrew was involved in many leadership roles. He spent one summer working on a sociology project with Dr. Winfield Fretz and one summer helping to lead a coffeehouse program at Grand Bend under the leadership of John and Louise Miller. In his professional career, Andrew has been a leader in children's health. Working for over 30 years at the Hinks Delcrest Treatment Center in Toronto. Here he has served as family worker, program supervisor, and ultimately program director. Since 1988, he has had responsibilities that have included open custody services for youth and children's mental health prevention and early intervention services. At the center, Andrew led the international team which provided training and early child development to partner agencies in more than 20 countries with the assistance of the Canadian International Development Agency. Andrew has been asked to provide leadership to the church and church-related ministries, and this has been a focus of his voluntary service. At the Mennonite Church Assembly in Vancouver in 2012, Andrew completed his term as moderator. He was at the helm of the denomination during some difficult times after integration. He also served three years as moderator of Mennonite Church Eastern Canada, MCEC and six years on the Grable board, three as its chair. We're not done. Andrew has also served as consultant with Associates Resource Resourcing the Church, or ARC, and assisted with many congregations as they examined their unique missions and structures. In fact, Andrew served as a consultant to the Conrad Grable board in 2006 as the college worked to shape a strategic plan. Andrew says this about Conrad Grable. Grable has done an outstanding job of supporting students and provides thoughtful theological leadership for the church. It is gratifying to see how Grable has developed over the past 50 years and how much the church has benefited from their vision. The Grable Distinguished Alumni Service Award recognizes alumni who have made a significant and unique contribution to the church, community, nation, or world. As Wendy Cressman Zare, who is with us today and chair of the Alumni Committee, puts it, Conrad Grable graduates need to see alumni who follow their passions and volunteer their time in important social issues and for furthering God's kingdom in the church. Grable students will hear more from Andrew at a community supper in the fall, but today it gives me great pleasure to call Andrew Reeser McDowell to the stage to receive the 2013 Distinguished Alumni Award. Andrew. <laughs> Thank 
President uh, Schultz Hooksman and Wendy Cressman Zare, Chair of the Alumni Committee, thank you for this award. When I reflect on my time at Grable, three things stand out. Firstly, the professors and leadership staff cared for the students. They demonstrated interest and support for an integrated Christian development, Christian practice, and academic development. I experienced a balance between encouragement and a challenge to think and contribute. Secondly, the environment at Grable encouraged new friendships and meaningful relationships which have shaped and enriched my life and the paths that I have taken. Thirdly, there was a consistency between what I understood as the Anabaptist Mennonite understandings and the way that Grable functioned. For example, the community supports, community events, chapel, and service opportunities. I am grateful that Grable is inspired by its Christian identity and its Anabaptist Mennonite heritage as it continues to pursue justice in service to the church and society. I continue to be thankful for the vision of the founders and the churches who very early saw the benefits of a church college in, on the university campus. And after 50 years, this continues to be an inspired vision and deserves our support. Thank you very much. <laughs>